Hello my friends and welcome back to King's Bounty. I was a little bit disappointed last time that my little exploit shenanigans didn't work out. But, uh... You know, that's part of... That's part of what makes, uh... You know, makes you good at strategy. Is thinking around stuff like that. And if it doesn't work, it doesn't work. It's not the biggest deal. But, um... There's a lot that you can, uh... You know, there's a lot you can learn from that episode, even if it was a little bit, a little bit boring and and it didn't quite work out as planned. I can get this guy. Yes, I can. I can just. No wait, one sixty nine. Yeah, that's that's it. So anyway, there are some enemies to clean up around here, which is what I'm going to do. <clears throat> and then there's a... Uh, we're going to go for the bear. So the bear is the... Uh, the bear is guarding the navigation map. And... Uh, I could take him right now, but there's an item that I want to pick up first. And get some kills. Because it will make that fight go so much more, uh, so much smoother and cleaner and nicer. Shields up. So this is a relatively easy battle here and you just gotta take your time. Slowly lure the enemy to their doom. If you wait, does that disappear? No. Only disappears when you actually take a turn. Burn him, boys. Oh, he's on fire. <clears throat> Your dudes are on fire. Three fifty. Not enough yet to murder with a trap. Uh, everyone's had their go this turn, so this is like a free hit for me if I want it. And I think I'll take it. Three, two, eight. I think I can drag this boy to his doom. One oh seven. So I need two hundred and twenty to finish the job. That's not necessarily guaranteed. But we can make it a guarantee. There are a couple of ways. First thing we can do is repair this dude. <clears throat> thus giving him... Okay, the chests are down there. I'm not going to take them yet because uh, these guys will steal them. We can repair the dude so he's got more attack power and we can also... Uh, damage this guy. <clears throat> Uh, 
Ugh. My perfect setup ruined by some goddamn snakes. Well, in that case, I'm gonna burn this guy's village. Oh, he's on fire! Excellent! <clears throat> Your bandit's on fire! Okay, let's, uh, let's trap this man. I might not get him. Hmm. Oh, he went for it! Oh no, he did a step over attack. <clears throat> well, that's okay. Someone is going into that trap. Three hundred and thirty-six. I don't think I have quite enough power. Ah, the complications of trying to uh, min-max. Okay, I could trap him. And that's what I'm gonna do. Let's move first before we do it though. That's a trap! <clears throat> oh, he went for it! Yes! He was trying to get an angle. And he paid the ultimate price for it. Now, I actually need to generate a little bit more mana here to get both of these. Well, actually I don't. I have enough mana for two traps and there are two of them, so... In theory I could get them both. It's a sweet spot that you've got to find. you got to try and lower them enough. So that you can drag them into a trap and kill them. But not so much. That, uh... That dragging them into the trap is actually, uh... They'll survive. Or, you know, you get them so low that you can't drag them without killing them. It's all the way over there. <clears throat> I messed up with the uh, mana cast here on this spell, but whatever. Sweet, free money. My favorite. Oh. 
Well, no matter what, this bandit's got too much health, so... Does he not have the across sector strike? Oh, he does. It just... It hasn't, uh... It hasn't cooled off. He's only got two movements, so... Good luck. Okay, he hurt me, but he didn't get a kill. Okay, he did the strike that turn, but he can't do that again. There we go. That was good. Oh. Alright, now we just need to get the old bandits. My heels are ready just in case he manages to do some real damage to somebody. Okay, I think we're ready to deal with this guy. Oh, perfect. How much health has he got? 261. The perfect amount for a glorious trapping. I don't think I should do any more damage to him. I think that's... Uh, as much as I want to do without risking him being too weak. Get over here. Nice. Happy days. Another five trap kills. I think once the next once we've got this, I think the next medal will probably be really difficult to get. So, uh... We can give that one a break for now. And then cast lots of fire spells instead. But trap kills are hard to get, so it's a good one to aim for to get done first. Especially since extra traps on the battlefield will come in handy later on when things get more difficult. Right, there's a couple of items up here which I can grab. I wanted to talk about this here. I think every island has got two nautical maps. And once you have the first, the first map reveals the next island. If you grab the second one, it will, um... This guy's a boss, so we want to avoid him at all costs. If you grab the second one, it gives you like a really powerful special uh, arcane bit of magic. But, uh... So our grand objective here is to kill this bear. And you'll note here that the bear has got, like, a royal snake retinue. Basically, you need to be powerful enough to kill the royal snakes fast. The bear can then be kited around, because it's slow. It does come with sprint, but the AI tends to waste it on the first turn. <clears throat> so its sprint doesn't really achieve anything for it. Right, I hate this bit. Hopefully the griffin is not there. So we want to claim an item, 
and that means going up here. I don't think there'll be any problems, but we'll see. Alright, sweet. So the next thing we want to do is take down this plant. There's the griffin. He wanders all the way down here, down here. He goes everywhere. He's a total pain in the ass. But we need not worry about him at this time. Okay. <clears throat> so as you can see here, we've got barbarians, bears, griffins, and this plant to deal with. I highly recommend in this fight just immediately powering down this plant so it can't summon hordes of spitty pains in the asses. It is a little bit inefficient to uh, fireball though. Burn! No, he didn't burn. Here comes House Gryffindor! <clears throat> These barbarians have actually not got a lot of health. Quite a bit of attack though. The bear must be avoided at all costs. Okay, the plant is already up to its summoning ways. As it stands, I actually really need to weaken these barbarians. They are relatively fast. And very powerful, attack-wise. The griffins are just annoying, and they'll slowly kill themselves as long as you just keep avoid being attacked. Um, as long as you avoid the bear, you'll be fine. I think you'll find that a lot of this game, for the next couple of episodes at least, will involve avoiding angry bears. Let's... oh yeah, I can't do it actually. So, as you can see, the Royal Thorn plant is pretty dangerous. At least we killed one of them. Okay, the treasure is all the way over there. Okay, that's fine. Okay, I need you to park here. Shields up. Unfortunately, it's gonna waste a turn uh, of it, but whatever. So of course they're all avoiding it. <laughs> 
Alright, one of them went for it. Well, they've made a nice, neat, complete wall here, so... At least the bear can't get to me. <clears throat> I'm gonna kick the bear just because I don't like its current position. These guys aren't a big deal. They will kill themselves constantly trying to trying to do harm to me, and that's okay. I'll grab this treasure with this bot. Okay. I could drag kill this boy, but I've got to worry about the... Uh... Oh, I know what to do. Because these two are going next, so I can't... I can't stop them from hitting my repair droid, but I can grab this guy and probably kill him. <clears throat> Slowly but surely, the griffins are dying. They are annoying, but that's all they are. Ah, why did you do that? Why didn't you just fire? I don't understand this game sometimes. Oh, he's super mega vulnerable to the bear now. Why didn't he just fire a long range shot? I've repaired it to full health. Oh, nice! Just to hope that that's enough. Okay. The bear's attack is not as strong as I had feared. Oh, I'd take massive casualties there. Okay. You gotta be really careful sometimes with this. You're expecting a ranged shot and uh, your troop decides, no, actually what I want to do is, uh, is not do a ranged shot, it's to go and run across the map and melee. Let's weaken this plant down as well. Okay. I sense a trap kill. I can smell griffin blood in the water. Now what we can do is we can abuse the bear for mana. Because it can't he can't realistically kill the guard droids, that's for sure. Guard droids, too strong. So, what we can do is we can move like here, set up defense mode, then put mana spring on. 
and also grab the last treasure. <clears throat> and basically allow the bear and the uh, guard droid to fight each other to death. The bear can only hit the guard droid, so he'll fight it. And I'll get mana for it. Oh, bear is angry. You do need to make sure that you top up your guard droids, obviously. Oh, that's major damage. Right. I think the time has come to once again avoid the bear. We've got repair work to do as well. We already grabbed all the treasures, so I can just push the bear around. <clears throat> I'd be tempted to kill the plant monster, but the plant monster is actually like to kill it outright. But the plant monster is actually the only guarantee that you will not accidentally kill the enemy with a counterattack. Burn boys. Oh, nice. And he's on fire. That ought to temper his enthusiasm for combat. Burn him, burn him, burn him. Your bear is on fire. That sounds like a euphemism. Get out of there. shield up and defend so I'm just gonna stand here and then wait so that I can move here and then wait Nice. Ah, oh, they've, they've come out in the wrong order. Oh, well, might as well just do damage to the bear. The enemy will counterattack. I have one thing of magic spring left, so. I would quite like the mana. Two hundred and twenty four. I think I might be able to trap him here, actually. 
59. So say 60. And 175. 235 minimum. Yeah, it's unlikely that I wouldn't get the kill here. Goodbye, bear. I barely knew you. Now, obviously, I've got to repair my droids before uh, <clears throat> before we leave the fight. Shouldn't be too difficult to do. These plant things are not strong. We know that we don't get anything for uh, attacking them. So we might as well not bother <clears throat> with spells or setting them on fire or trapping them or whatever. <clears throat> All of that is pointless, so we might as well just get stuck in. Okay. Let's fix this boy back up to full health and then we're done. That's it. Seven, 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 nine. We're good to go. It would be nice to trap this one, but you can't actually. Uh, <clears throat> I left it with too little health to trap it to death. And we're 17 rounds in anyway, so there's nothing else I could realistically do at this time. Uh, just shoot this guy to death. Ah! You pain in the ass. I just didn't want to have to waste time regenerating mana, that was all. Wrecked. In fact, I can just crushing blow this guy. Alright, we're done. Nice. Okay. Do you think we'll see bears? We can take this bear. But uh, a, a wise man has his manor back before he attempts that. Just checking if my uh, leadership would allow me. Alright, the griffin's moved out of the way. I can go and get the item I want. Not that, but I'll have it. Uh, nope. Although this is very interesting. That it puts a trap on the battlefield for you. An extra one. But uh, the problem is... It's an artifact, and the artifact slots are where all the nice items go. I already have some nice artifacts. It's an evil axe.
Kill it for me. I'm not going to kill it. Here we go, look. Plus three attack, plus three additional attack points for dwarves. It's going to make my first big purchase. Oh, the bear is coming back. We can take the bear, though. The griffin seems to be minding its own business. Grab the magic crystals while I'm at it. <clears throat> um, so the interesting thing about this is... Uh, my attack is terrible, anyway. Well, my stats are terrible because it's a mage. But... Um, Uh, I've got this largely equipped for the extra gold more than anything else and I've got this largely equipped for the leadership rather than anything else but this hammer gives three additional ta attack points for dwarves and uh, droids are considered to be dwarves for some reason so our attack improves hugely but droids it improves even more. All the way up to 33. And uh, 18 for the repair droids. And this is a huge difference for the repair droids. An extra 6 attack on base 10 is massive. And so this is what I wanted to get. was I wanted to get this hammer because it would allow me to... Uh, take down the bears faster by sniping away at them. Um, I think I said last time, there's nothing worth buying at my current at my current level of runes. I don't have enough runes to actually buy anything nice. Obviously I'd like higher magic next so I can cast two spells at certain points, which would be very helpful. Especially at the start of fights, you can just mag dump fire bolts into enemies. Right, just waiting for my mana to recharge. This uh, griffin is bad news. But he has a wide range of area that he likes to wander around. The bears we can take, no problem. Although there are many ways to go and deal with them. So I was thinking we would kill the bears and save the... Uh, the deadly bear for next time. Oh god, he's turned around. <laughs> it's all a question of timing here. Oh, he's coming down this way. This guy is also uh, pretty much unstoppable. What a pain in the ass this griffin's being. I might have to worry about killing the bears next time. Not that there really needs to be a limit on the amount of time that I spend on these episodes. If the griffin is down here, you do not want to run past it. Because then it will just come up behind you and you'll be trapped. So, that's a bad idea. Do not, under any circumstances, think that you can just run past it while it's down here and get back out again alive. It's all tight corridors. You got nowhere to go. <clears throat> and likewise, don't see this bear is here now. Don't attack it unless you know that the griffin is miles away. Because it will come down here and trap you in. This is not the bear that's that we're gonna attack next episode, obviously. Let's go. I think we'll see bears. Honestly, it's like a whole group of bears, but they're not actually big stacks, so... You might reasonably expect to kill them all. Each stack's got like... 190 health. Two 
250, potentially 260. Probably easier to just try and burn him. Okay, unlucky on the burnination there. Oof. So they're all using their sprint right now. Um, let's blind this one. Then pull back slightly. Your bear is on fire. That sounds really wrong. I'm just going to stand up here with this one. Just to try and not get caught in the corner. There's only five bears there. Let's turn the fence mode on. Let's try and put some hurt into this boy. Mana spring, go! Then fly away. The bear is mad. Ha! Huh, they turned around, which is perfect. Because chasing after these is fine, because they're fast. I wonder. Can I actually trap kill this boy? What's his health? 102. I think I can, you know, I'll just put the trap here. Beam of light is ass. This battle will be grisly. Not made enough fury yet to actually, uh... Nice. Not made enough fury yet to actually work out where the treasure is. May have to actually risk my droids taking some damage to generate some rage. Yes, he's burning! How long is this going to last for one turn? Oh, sweet. <laughs> the treasure is right there. Let's grab one straight away.
Two bears, 132. I think... I think he'll move towards me here. Yep, he did. Perfect. We put the trap here and the bear will walk into it. We're going to have a bit of a, a fight now, but it's deliberate. Because, uh... I need to generate some rage to get the second treasure. And that only occurs if you actually take some losses. Oh! He barely hurt me. Ah. <laughs> uh. Get out of there. Right, I need to actually take some losses here. This is actually going too perfectly. I've not generated enough rage to pick up the uh, second treasure. Uh, defense mode active. Magic spring. Go. For the armor rather than the mana regen. Oh, I've got enough rage now. For some reason. I'm not going to shoot the bear because when you shoot it, it doubles its attack. So I'll just let it attack and then heal up after. Oh, big hit. Bears are slow. Repair is complete. I'll grab that next turn. Basically, you have to be careful about provoking the bear when it's in melee combat with one of your dudes. You don't want to trigger its ability to get double attack. When it receives damage, attack is doubled until the end of the round. Does not influence bear's counterattacks. So in other words, you very much don't want to shoot it. When you are meleeing it. Seventy-five. He did not actually manage to kill any of my droids there. Alright, burn his ass. Oh, he's on fire! And it's round nine, so that counts. Perfect. Alright, he's had his go, so let's put the hurt on him. Uh, 351. 127 plus 175 is 302. 302 is my minimum. I need 351. 
<coughs> That's actually a relatively high roll. I need to damage this more. And I think I can get him in a trap kill. Oh, he's going next. Set up the trap so my dude doesn't get hit. This will be grizzly. Not everyone can handle the wholesale slaughter of wild animals, you know. This kind of gameplay is very polarizing. <laughs> uh, I think I'm a bad person. Oh! Uh, no, that guarantees two kills. I'm not doing it. Not even for the EXP. I'd rather have the trap kill. Oh, he avoided the trap! Apparently not as dumb as it looks. Hmm. Let's try again, shall we? Stand on my trap! There we go. Bear slaughter. All right, so we are good to go. I only needed the hammer anyway. I didn't really need to kill the bears, but I did. Yeah, whatever you say, dude. I wonder how we're doing on the old uh, trap kills. I only need two more trap kills. Sweet. Well, I'm not about to get them in this next fight. But that's quite cool. And I only need to use the flay the fire arrow another 14 times in combat in the first 10 turns. And I only need four more wins without a loss, which I'm sure we can find somewhere. So we are about to power up in a big way. We are really about to power up in a big way. So this troop is marked as invincible. And I'm pretty sure that you're not meant to take it down just yet. But next time we're going to take it down because uh, we can take it down. I know I can. Because honestly, it's just a giant pile of bears. And bears can be kited and avoided and, and picked down. So that's what we're going to do. Anyway, I hope you guys enjoyed it. And I will see you guys next time.